Sex robots are so creepy, they'll haunt your dreams. Robots aren't just going to take our jobs, they're also going to scare the pants off of us. Just because we can build robots doesn't mean we always should. From industrial robots that help assembly lines complete their products faster and more accurately, to social robots that can interact with humans, it's clear that there's no limit to the creativity and ingenuity behind robotics. However, as it turns out, some of these robots are so creepy that even thinking about them late at night might give you nightmares. Here are six of the creepiest robots in existence today. But before that, don't forget to smash the like button and subscribe. Think you like what you see? Then also be sure to hit that bell icon while you are at it to ensure that you are notified every time we come out with a fresh new piece of content for you. That being said, let's begin. Robots are one of the newest inventions to hit the market, but they're also one of the most popular items in technology. You might have seen some of these robots before, but others might surprise you. Some of them will even creep you out if they don't scare you away first. In no particular order, here are six robots that just might make your skin crawl. Just be careful where you point your fingers, or camera lenses, or arms. Okay, maybe not your arms. Number one, Sophia by Hansen Robotics. The humanoid robot, Sophia, first caught headlines when she debuted at the 2015 World Economic Forum in Davos, Switzerland. She was designed to appear like Audrey Hepburn and can hold conversations with humans using AI technology that's sophisticated enough to respond in a variety of ways depending on what others say. Although she has a body made of plastic and metal, her face is made up of incredibly realistic looking flesh. It's easy to see why people have been unnerved by her lifelike appearance, and it doesn't help that Hansen Robotics is owned by founder David Hansen, who once said he wants his robots to become the new race. Sophia is a state-of-the-art humanoid robot that can mimic a range of human facial expressions and display intelligence, awareness, and interactivity. A unique characteristic of Sophia is her ability to learn new concepts and draw upon them in future conversations with people. She's also able to read and answer questions from a large repository of general knowledge. This makes her not only an impressive conversationalist, but also an informative one too. What's more, she has been programmed with emotions like happiness, anger, and surprise, which make interactions even more realistic. Creepy indeed, but don't worry, Sophia isn't going to replace you just yet. She only has about 80 facial expressions compared to an average human's thousands. So, for now, she probably won't be taking your job anytime soon. Number 2. Big Dog by Boston Dynamics Big Dog is a four-legged robot being developed by Boston Dynamics with funding from DARPA as part of its legged squad support system, LS3 program. The LS3 program aims to create robots capable of assisting soldiers in carrying heavy loads for 20 kilometers without needing to be refueled or resupplied. Big Dog has been in development since at least 2005 and is powered by an off-bore hydraulic pump, like its predecessor, Little Dog. Its legs are articulated like an animal's and it uses sensors in its head to avoid obstacles, navigate rough terrain, and even walk upstairs. It can carry up to 180 kilograms, which means it could potentially be used as a pack mule for military operations. It runs on a Linux operating system. Although Big Dog was originally designed for military purposes, it has many civilian applications as well. For example, it could be used in search and rescue missions where there are hazards such as mud or snow that would inhibit wheeled or tracked vehicles. Number 3. CB2 by Osaka University This giant, human-sized robot walks upright on two legs and weighs around 285 pounds. Its name is CB2, which stands for Computerized Humanoid Experimental Robot, and it can be yours if you're a university looking to conduct research on humanoid robots. CB2 is also pretty strong. It can lift up to 45 pounds with each arm, a feat that even most humans would struggle with, Oh, and did we mention that its head turns from side to side? It does. It moves its head from side to side as it walks towards you with arms outstretched in an attempt to give you a hug. Creepy indeed, but don't worry. Researchers have said they won't let CB2 into your home until it learns how to act more like a human. And by acting more like a human, they mean acting less like an evil robot hellbent on taking over Earth. As if you could trust them. No word yet on when CB2 will be ready for mass production, so keep those doors locked tight. Number 4. Talking Robot by Japan's Kagawa University 
It's about as smart as a cockroach. Kangaroo is actually a great deal more sophisticated than that, but there's no denying its clunky, unsteady gait makes it difficult to watch for more than a few seconds. With each step, Kangaroo flexes its chest and stomach muscles to create enough force to lift its legs off the ground. A sensor in its foot tells it where to swing forward again. The movement isn't quite natural yet, but researchers at Japan's Kagawa University have been working on their human-like android since 2010, and they say they plan to make him even better. The team says robots like Kangaroo could be used in nursing homes or other places where humans need assistance moving around. But if you ask us, we think he looks just fine exactly how he is now. He'll give us nightmares either way. Number 5. Geminoid by Hiroshi Ishiguro Hiroshi Ishiguro, a professor at Osaka University and director of the Intelligent Robotics Laboratory, created Geminoid. This is a replica of himself, with pneumatic actuators allowing it to move and speak in a similar way to its human counterpart. Ishiguro claims that he has always dreamed of creating an android who was identical to him. In order to achieve his dream, he must understand what it means to be human. He says that by building robots, such as Geminoid, he can learn more about being human and how we interact with each other. It's almost like looking into a mirror. The robot looks exactly like him, but when you talk to it, you realize that there is something not quite right about it. When asked if he would have sex with his robot doppelganger, Ishiguro said, no comment. Number 6. Saya by Tokyo University of Science The Saya is a humanoid robot designed to look human. It is operated by voice and facial recognition and looks like a young woman in her 20s with short hair. The head can turn 180 degrees, and it has a built-in microphone, camera, speaker, and lamp. The robot can also sing and dance, as well as display simple facial expressions using LEDs. It will be used for educational purposes and research into human interaction. We can also have some other robots as well. One of them is Event. Developed by researchers at Georgia Tech, Event was created to help people suffering from chronic respiratory diseases such as cystic fibrosis or asthma. This robotic vest inflates when triggered by sensors placed on patients' chests and automatically deflates after two minutes of treatment. Remote control lets users choose between different levels of inflation to treat their symptoms. The other one is CareRobot 3, designed to assist elderly and disabled people with daily tasks. CareRobot 3 is a mobile platform that moves around on wheels. It features five joints that allow it to move its arms, neck, and torso while keeping its hands free for work. Its eyes are equipped with cameras that allow them to detect objects up to 10 meters away. These robots have gotten a lot of attention online. If we're talking about robots, they don't get much more lifelike than these guys. Some robots are so weird and creepy, they're enough to give you nightmares. Just looking at them is enough to make your skin crawl. And if you think that's scary, just wait until you see what happens when they start moving. It's hard to tell whether these bots are actually haunted or not. But even if they aren't possessed by some kind of demon spirits, there's no denying that they're still pretty darn freaky. No matter how cute and cuddly robots become in our imagination, it seems like we always will be scared by those eerie stares and spooky movements. Who knows, maybe one day we'll all be able to live with them side by side as pets. Until then, let us know which robot from our list creeps you out the most in the comments below. That's it for the day, guys. Next time, we'll bring you a more spectacular batch of technology-related news. If you loved this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and turn on the notification bell to view more of our weekly robotics and new technology updates. We'll see you again soon in the next one. Until then, peace.